It's homecoming weekend here in Happy Valley as we visit with Lisa Salters, who is back for homecoming. She's a grand marshal in the parade this year. Hopefully you were able to see her yesterday do her thing in the parade, but Lisa, finally back home here at Penn State. How's it feel? It feels fantastic. There's nothing like coming home. They, you know, that's what they always say. Um, just, you know, driving up here from my home in Baltimore, driving through the mountains and remembering uh, back to when I was 18, 19, 20, uh, coming up here, just seeing how much everything is the same, how much it's changed. Uh, it's just great to be back. What did it mean to you to be able to wear that logo and everything that that entails? It meant everything. I mean, I'm from outside of Philadelphia, so that's a very strong Penn State country. Um, so just, you know, just looking at it on your shirt, it's just, uh, it's just so iconic and it means something. When you go around the country and people find out that you went to Penn State, um, that means something. I mean, we're not any better than any other university or any other college, but it, uh, you know, that that name, Penn State, it means something to people all over, all over the country, and you know, you do have such great pride. When you're going to walk back inside that stadium on Saturday yeah, and the 107,000 plus, why is it going to be something? Um, because when you know, when I was here, I was, you know, I was just a. When I left, I was just a 22-year-old who was hoping not to mess up. You know, I wanted to go out and, you know, I wanted to do good things, but, uh, you know, my goal was really just not to, not to mess up, um, just be solid. And so to be invited back uh, last year as the commencement speaker and now this year as the Grand Marshal, it means that, you know, for whatever reason, the folks here are proud of me and they think that I did something right. Now you were able to visit with Coach Franklin on Friday. How was that meeting and can you just speak about the job that he's done with this program? It was great meeting him and I, um, just a really good guy. I wanted to know, I was like, you know, you've done such a great job here at Penn State. What's the, what's your secret? And you know, he was telling me what a lot of the great ones say. say. Uh, it's about establishing relationships and you know, getting to, to know the student athletes, not just as athletes, or just to students, but just getting to know them, you know, getting to know them, their families, and, and building from there. So he's done, he's done a great job. Well, Penn State kicks off 3.30 Eastern time right inside Beaver Stadium against Michigan State. Lisa, appreciate you stopping by Thank and you. enjoy your time, all right? Appreciate it.